Uh, welcome to Coldstone. I get my daughter back next week. There's a reason! So the fact that we pulled off slavery, <laughs> I've already said it's awful. What is up, guys? These are your inaugural comedy clips, funnish comedy clips of the week. Don't know what I want to call it. Don't care what I'm going to call it. You don't care either. You just want to see the comedian, so I'm going to let you do that. I am sorry for interrupting your time. I'll see you at the end of the video, y'all. Late. What do you guys think the best brand of ice cream? Not flavor, brand. Someone said Cold Stone. Here's the problem with Cold Stone. They make the employees sing to you. Many of those people are at the lowest point of their life. Nobody wants to hear this. Oh, welcome to Cold Stone. I get my daughter back next week. Ben and Jerry's always has one thing that does not belong in the ice cream. It's like, we have fudge and M&Ms and pieces of my couch. What else? Blue Bell that just had a fucking E. coli recall? How about you? How does that even happen? What is some meth head drop a chicken wing in the vat? Hagen dazs is very Nazi ish, let's be honest. Hagen dazs, our only flavor is vanilla! Dairy Queen does not even advertise that they're good. Dairy Queen's only advertisement is that they can hand you their product upside down. First of all, someone just said Dippin' Dots. Some husk of a human being in the back just said Dippin' Dots, the ice cream that tastes like rocks. Here's a joke that you can tell down at, at school, when school starts. A bear and a rabbit are taking a shit in the woods. <laughs> and the bear turns to the rabbit and says, excuse me, you have problems with shit sticking to your fur? And the rabbit says, no. So the bear wiped his ass with the rabbit. Flew here from New York. Man, I hate flying. You know, they let you pick your seat on a plane. I think I'd rather pick the person I'm sitting next to. I don't really give a shit where I am on the plane. It's like a five-hour relationship. Make it more like a dating app. Obese Nazi with a service dog? Swipe left. <laughs> Tiny Asian lady with a surgical mask? That's my gal. Yes, she is not a talker, right? But just like a dating app, she shows up with a baby. I'm like, ah, I got catfished. <laughs> Hate the small talk. Two things I can't do, small talk and eye contact. How sad is that, you know? I basically have all the traits of a serial killer, just without the ambition. <laughs> I'm working on it. People always say, Mark, gotta be more confident. They say, Mark, gotta be yourself. I'm like, well, you gotta pick one. <laughs> I love women, I swear to God. It doesn't, may not seem like it. I fucking love women, what am I gonna do? It's so funny, they're always on the ice cream. Well, how come you don't talk about me? How come you don't say what's wrong with me? How come you only talk about what, what women do? How come you only... Uh, there's a reason! There's a fucking reason! Because a man never broke my fucking heart! A man never lied to me in love! A man never made me want to drive my car into a fucking wall! There's nothing more shameful in our country's past than slavery. Okay, that's horrible. But I've grown up in a generation where I've idolized black people my entire life. They are better at everything. So the fact that we pulled off slavery, I've already said it's awful. That's off the table. I'm just saying it's kind of neat. I mean, at any point, they could have been like, you know we can just run away, right? And you will never catch us. And if you do, we will beat the living shit out of you. All right. That's about how well that joke should go over. I've had it. I'm working, I'm trying. You go down, and you get this Mr. Even Keeled all the time with his little fucking sport coat, right? You live with that guy for a while, you know? Hey, honey, I'm home, how are you? Well, traffic was crazy, almost lost it, but thank God I had that book on tape, right? <laughs> Gulliver's Travels, always a classic, always a classic. That's the guy you want, straight across the board, even in the bedroom, right? Always making love to you, missionary style, I love you, your hair is like an ocean. 
Never know when you like to be flipped over and have your face mushed into the pillows. You fucking psycho, right? If you're watching the parade, make sure you stand in one spot. Don't follow it. It never changes. <laughs> and if you don't like the parade, run in the opposite direction. You will fast forward the parade. <laughs> <laughs> Let me know what you guys think. Follow me on TikTok and Instagram for the most up-to-date comedy clips. I'm talking the most recent ones get posted there. We're like a month ahead at that point. At this point. Anyway, let me know what you guys think. Thank you very much. Adios. And I ain't cultural appropriating.